One tit at a time. Imagine if it just dropped the towel right at the end. <laughs> How to measure your dick. Should we do that next? Three, two, one. Oh, that's so cold! Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. So today is a very silly video to start off the new year and I'm gonna be weighing my boobs. I'm gonna find out how much these bad boys weigh. This is something that I've been curious about for a very long time. I've always wanted to know, and so we're doing it. And we're doing it for a video, so I have an excuse to actually finally get around to weighing my boobs. I have a theory that my boobs change weight during my cycle. They at least feel like they do, but whether that translates to like actual weight mass change, I have no idea. That, however, is an experiment for another day because I'm currently pregnant. So that is the disclaimer of like, this is the weight of my pregnant boobs. And then that also might change with breastfeeding boobs. And then like back to having a regular menstrual cycle, boobs weight will be different. My boobs have definitely gotten bigger during pregnancy. There are some bras that <laughs> do not fit anymore, but that's just where we're at. I have my lovely assistant, Dan, here, da -da -da -da, to protect my decency, because that's what a good husband is for. Ain't that right? Is it? <laughs> okay, so we have a few different methods that we're gonna try. I bought these like larger kitchen scales specifically uh, for this video. <laughs> And then I also have a baking tray to collect whoop, water in. And then depending on my boob size, we've got two saucepans, which, which do you think? Emily will probably be easier with the larger one. So that's all for the water displacement method, which is gonna be the trickiest one, but the most accurate, probably. I have a WikiHow article ready to go. I also am tempted just to see like how much they weigh just by flopping them onto the scales and seeing how that compares. That will be less accurate. And then the other way, which we're gonna start with, is estimating my boob weight based on my bra size. Now, this is a new method to me, we will see. It's also on this WikiHow article. And it's in US bra sizes, um, which I don't really understand, but we're gonna do it and then see what that converts to in terms of boob weight. So the first thing, lovely assistant, that I need you for is to help me measure me tits. We need to find out my band size, which is this bit, and then my bust size, which goes around here. Do I need to like, just be in my bra for this? Okay, so can you read that? I can't read that. Yeah, that is when Eight and a half. Okay, 28, like which one is it closer to? We need a whole number. Oh no, actually, probably, yeah, 29. We'll say 29. 29. Yeah, 29. We'll 29. Say 29, okay. Ooh. Right, so 29 is an odd number, so we have to add five to it. So 34. So my back size is 34 in the US. Then we measure the boobies at the fullest point just over the nipple. Just you over. focus on where the band goes. And all yeah, it's just over the nipple. Move. And then it just you just round it up to the nearest whole number. Oh, it says it's best to do without a bra on, but this is a bralette, so. Yeah, it shouldn't make too much difference. Uh, 36. 36? Oh, is it, ra is it specifically round up? It says round up. 37 yeah. then. 37, okay. So, what did I say my back size was? 34. And then the bust is 37. So then, subtract your band size from your bust size to calculate your cup size. So my difference is <coughs> 34, 37. So my difference is three inches. I'm a C cup? That's not true. I think the issue we currently have is you're much wider here than you were previously. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, not a seeker. The issue is, like, <laughs> this is poking out almost immediately. This so, is my pregnant so. belly. <laughs> okay. That is, because even in US sizes, that's got to be wrong. Because in the UK, I'm like a 30 double G. Well, let's just see what this, let's, let's follow through. Let's keep going down this rabbit hole. 34C is approximately 0.9 pounds or 0.41 kilograms per breast. Okay. Right, so now it's time for the more risky measurements and my assistant is uh, 
closing the blinds. Our blinds are blue, so if I suddenly get really blue and dark, that is why. Right, so now we're gonna do the flopping breast onto the thingy. Right, ready? What's the best way to do this, you think? Just like a flop? One tit at a time? <laughs> right, boot number one. <laughs> Did you hear that? That is, it's varying quite a lot. I think oh high, God. like one, 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 four, two grams, I'm gonna say. I'm, the squatting is hard. Okay, so that's boob, that's the right boob. Ready? Bloop. That 100, one, 135 ish or something like that. But it, it's fluctuating so much, the measurement's almost completely meaningless. Right, success. Okay. Now we need to. Do water. So the method is weigh this. This is eight, so we need to write this down 884.4 grams. So now, yeah, fill that up. Thank you, assistant. It has to be like rimming. rimming. I understand. <laughs> Brim. so, brimming. Brimming. Not rimming. <laughs> I think put it in here, and then what we can do is we can top it up. Yeah, because that needs to be topped There you go, that's pretty much it. Okay, ready? Get the towel out. The tit's about to go into a big saucepan of water. Right, I hope that it all... Because I'm nervous that some of it's going to spill out onto the table. It goes slowly and it shouldn't do. Okay. Three, two, one. Oh, that's so cold! Oh yeah, I should have used warm water, shouldn't I? Oh, God. <laughs> go on. Keep lowering, keep lowering, uh, keep lowering, keep lowering. I think my whole tit's in. No. No? No. You need to like really straighten your, you need to lean right forwards. I am leaning right forwards. I don't think you're tall enough. <laughs> keep going, keep going, keep going. Um, it's touching Give me your my... shoulder, get your shoulder to touch the rim of okay, the Okay, there we go. But some of it has spilled. All right, there we go. the table. <laughs> Can I have a towel, please? Thank you. <laughs> that was very cold. So now we'll just re we remove. That is a lot of oil that <laughs> got displaced just there. We lost a tiny bit, so we'll add a couple of grams. Tiny bit there and a tiny bit there got missed the tray. Science. So one, 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 point, three. one point three five kilos. All right. So write that down because we actually the wiki how article need to has a it yeah because it's like to boob density to boob density not water density. We love me some wiki how. I wonder what else they've got on here. How to measure your dick. Should we do that next? Um, I mean, surely that's just the tape measure if it doesn't come. Well, no, weighing it. You can also do this method for your head, but just be careful about submerging your head into a bowl of water. Yes, try not to drown. <laughs> I love that it says, tip, this method is easiest if you have relatively large or droopy breasts, but not a lot of abdominal fat. To get an accurate result, you'll need to be able to get the entire breast into the container without dipping any of Yeah, I did that. Okay, so we are going to times it by 0.9. Oh, okay. Multiply the weight of the water by 0.9 since breast tissue and water have slightly different densities. That's why it floats. Why tits float. Because hmm, I left it. Uh, 1.21. 1.21 kilos. That's mm. how much one of my boobs weighs. Mm -hmm. So what? So <laughs> let's see what the difference is. So with the silly measurement, the the US bra size that thought I was a 34C, it is 0 0.41. Is that meant to be kilos? <laughs> that's per per breast. Oh, per breast, <laughs> not pound. Oh no, pounds is LB. <laughs> yeah, that's pounds per breast. Oh, I see, yeah. So 0 0.41 kilos per breast for the measurement. Then we got just 142 grams and 135 grams for the flop the tit on the scale method. And then from a more accurate, but maybe not entirely accurate, one of my boobs, my right boob specifically, weighs 1.21 kilos. That's so much weight to be carrying around on my chest. Two of those. That's heavy. Wow. Well, there we have it. What? Oh, we should have guessed beforehand. Too late now. <laughs> I would have probably guessed about a kilo. Really? Okay. Yeah. I have no idea. Fair enough. Right. Well. There you have it. Have you ever weighed your boobs at home? How much did they weigh? Let us know. Have you ever tried to weigh your head or your foot or any other body part using this method? Would love to 
<laughs> no. Do any of you have heavier boobs than me? Probably. What's that like? Thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video. I'm gonna go and put my clothes back on now. Ooh. Imagine if they just dropped the towel right at the end. <laughs> Oh,